Okay, you guys, you can't see me right now, and honestly, it's for your own good. Anyways, I'm at the gym. Look at the dirtiness of the window. No, it's not gonna focus. Is it gonna focus? There we go. And I'm about to get a fucking leg workout in. <sighs> Also, my natural hair is out. You can't really see it, and trust me, you don't need to. People are gonna be staring at me, but you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it, all right? Oh, okay, let's do it, let's do it. Okay, so this is gonna, okay, let's just, let's just do it. Let's just get into it. Wow, I look disgusting. Okay, let's do it. Before I can even get my workout started, I had to put on my knee sleeves. I don't know when my knees became so bad, because I'm only 25, but, all I know is if I don't wear these, my knees will be hurting for the entire week. So, so first I am starting off with some reverse lunges. I absolutely love these when it comes to glutes. Um, I kept the weight pretty light for these because I really wanted to focus on my form, you know, keeping my back straight and making sure that I'm putting all of my weight on my front leg when I come up. If the weight was really heavy, um, I wouldn't have been able to lunge as deep as I would like. Also, I probably wouldn't have been able to come up. So there's that. The next exercise is the holy grail of a glute day, the hip thrust with the band, okay? When I do hip thrust, y'all, I can't even begin to explain the feeling that I be having in my glutes. It is a staple, and if my glutes are not sore from a previous workout, then I always try to include it. With hip thrust, my weight does vary. If I'm doing low reps, like six to eight reps, then my weight will be really, really high. But here I was actually doing four sets of 20, um, mainly because it's been a while since I've done high rep hip thrust, so I just kind of wanted to switch it up a little bit. Next we have RDLs, and I'm gonna be honest, I usually don't do these with dumbbells, but I was just trying something new. Um, when you are doing these, you are supposed to be hinging at the hips, and I don't really recommend coming all the way up like I was doing, because you kinda wanna keep the tension in your hamstrings. This is one of those cases where you should do as I say and not as I do. See y'all, those RDLs fucked me up, okay? I had to put on a belt, because I knew that if I did not put on one, then I was about to, sacrifice my form for the rest of these exercises so next we have the goblet squat and these are pretty standard um, when I do these I like to make sure that my toes are kind of pointed out that way I can target my glutes a little bit more um, here I like to make sure that my back is straight and really putting all of my weight on my heels when I'm coming up also with these you want to make sure you are going heavy in weight I think I was holding around 60 pounds in my hand all right split lunges I fucking love these, even though at this point I was definitely struggling. With these, you want to make sure your knee doesn't go over your ankle. And also, the deeper you sink with these, the more you can really feel it in your glutes. I also decided to up my weight on these. I know for a fact that I was holding 30 pounds in each hand because the moment I picked them up, I started regretting it. For my finisher, I have to credit Winnie Simmons because that's who I got these from. And believe me, y'all, they are killer. I don't even know what these are called. I just know they hurt. All right. So first, you're going to start off with 15 reps of banded squats with a dumbbell in your hand. Once you finish those 15 reps, then you're going to go straight into another 15 reps of seated three fourth squats. And then once you finish those reps, you're gonna go straight into another 15 pulses. When I tell you this shit burns, it burns, but it feels so good. You got to try them. You've got to incorporate them in your workout. Believe me, you are going to love them. So shout out to Whitney Simmons because your girl put me on and now I'm obsessed. And that is going to be all for this video. So make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. By the way, this fine ass dude walked in and the last 10 minutes of my workout, I couldn't focus.